guys, Angela here, and today I'm gonna share. You're a great fucking talker, but you're a shit cook. I can't believe just how inconsistent you are. Get out! Get out! Okay, okay, okay. Um, today Gordon Ramsay's gonna teach me how to make scrambled eggs. Yes, scrambled eggs. No scrambled eggs. Scrambled eggs. Ready? Scrambled eggs. That's Three, that's four. Scrambled eggs. Oh my baby, how I love your legs. Not as much as I love scrambled eggs. Oh, we should eat some scrambled eggs. So we're at my stovetop. That's why the lighting right here is very um illuminescence if that's even a word um apparently gordon ramsay's most viral video the video that has like 37 million views is a scrambled egg recipe granted i've never actually watched it um i make scrambled eggs and i'm just surprised that people don't know how to make scrambled eggs so this is basically going to be like a first impression follow along video so all right gordon ramsay you're up Teach me how to make some scrambled eggs. Everyone should have a proper breakfast. My perfect breakfast, scrambled egg, sautéed mushrooms, and tomatoes. The most important thing about any scrambled egg is stopping it from overcooking. Wait, huh, wait, to hold on, what? Sautéed onion, what? Sautéed tomatoes and mushrooms? Okay, yeah, that sounds great, but I'm just not gonna do that. I don't have that item, so we're just gonna skip forward. And second of all, why does Gordon Ramsay sound like he, he can't catch a breath? Breakfast. Never get a chance to eat it Monday to Friday, but Saturday, Sunday, however, is the time when everyone should have a- Like, he's in a marathon. He's like, ah, I need to- Fantastic! Ah, ah, ah. Oh my god. Oh, this video is already giving me anxiety. That was right. That looks great. Just Actually, I'm whole. starving. That looks delicious, in. but I don't- a bit I thought soft. we're making scrambled eggs, pepper. guys, not a- <laughs> Nothing worse than going into a restaurant, having scrambled egg on toast, and having soggy toast. This yeah, nothing's worse than soggy toast. Like, who eats soggy? Use it for scrambled eggs because it's strong, robust, and it's got a lovely flavour to it. But be quite generous when you cut it because you don't want this sort of little thin... Okay, so he looks like he's serving the scrambled eggs with sourdough. Is the lighting better? Okay. I don't have sourdough, but I do have brioche. I mean, I have brioche. You just pop it into the toaster oven, so... Is that a pan? Is that a pot? Because if you put the salt in now, what actually happens, it breaks down the eggs. And it starts Don't turning into something Don't season it. very watery. So, eggs in the pan. Nice knob of butter. And it's really important to put the butter in... No, we don't like watery egg. Okay, so I have my pot. Usually in scrambled eggs, I use a pan. And so he's using, what, three eggs? So he's just cracking it in cold. That's kind of weird. All right. Cold. <laughs> Harry doesn't look right to me. Right at the very beginning, because what that does, it starts giving a really nice velvety finish to scrambled egg. Velvety finish? And then a simple spatula. A s okay. Onto the heat, and then whisk the egg. Whisk, uh, whisk it in the pan. Sort of I don't have... You've got to break it down in the pan. What? Okay, I have the spatula. Back to the heat. Okay. Get off the heat. On. And treat it like a risotto. Treat it like a risotto. The heat. And then just off. let it work. And then I just do on. this three or four times. All Back right. onto the heat. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> off the heat. Oh. Damn, 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 I'm going to set the fire alarms off. That'll wake up the missus. Okay, here we go. Put that back. Hold up. Did he just burn toast? The Gordon Ramsay? Burnt his toast. Could you imagine in Hell's Kitchen if one of his like com the people who are competing on that show burnt toast? His freaking reaction. What are you? An idiot sandwich. Idiot sandwich what? An idiot sandwich, Chef Ramsay. And look at him. Look, he's just a regular old person. He's just like you and me, burning toast. Granted, I don't think I've really burnt toast because my toaster got a timer, and I know how to. Toast. Quickly. Toasted. Toast. The missus. Okay, here we go. Put that back in. So, on and off the heat. Right, off the heat. Then. Because the heat is in there. That's where the heat is. 
So look, if I had to leave that there now, it would overcook. But it's not going to overcook because I'm going to put half a tablespoon of creme fraiche. Did he just say creme fraiche into the eggs? Um, luckily for you, Gordon, I have some creme fraiche. Fresh. If you don't know what creme fraiche is, it's like a French style curdled cream. Think, think like, I don't know, like a really rich yogurt mixed with like a heavy cream and uh, cream cheese, I guess. Um, so yeah, so he's adding that into his eggs. That's kind of strange. All right, let's, let's add a thing of creme fraiche to your eggs. Cool down my eggs. There we go. Wow, guys, that looks almost undercooked. It doesn't look right to me. Okay. Salt and pepper. Uh, chives, again. Lucky for you, Gordon, I have chives lying around. Most people don't, jeez. Okay, to serve it. Ready to go. Off. Off. Right, on. Wow, that's much more <laughs> liquid than I'm used to. But it's cooked. It's per Gordon Ramsay. Wow. And that's it. So that's it that's gordon ramsay's scrambled egg recipe and it is a very european style very french because this is not what i'm used to um so let's give it a try he's right the eggs really do have a velvety finish to them I could see why he wanted the sourdough because the sourdough has a bit more sourness to it to really cut the the richness of the eggs but the eggs very rich creamy you could really taste the eggs they're not like the scrambled eggs that you usually have at a diner where granted are overcooked because they're they're much firmer than you're used to this type of style of scrambled egg needs to be eaten with something crunchy like toast as you can see here, like it's kind of like a spread. It's kind of like you're adding like cream cheese or like butter or like some kind of avocado spread on top of your toast. It's just like that. Um, I enjoy this. This is a different way of eating scrambled eggs that I'm not used to. It's almost very decadent. Like it feels fancier because we're using the creme fraiche the butter, the chives, even the toast. Well, yeah, Gordon Ramsay got something going on here. I'm not, I can see why that's one of his most popular videos because honest to God, this, this is something. Mm. Don't forget to subscribe and like to this video if you want to be taught by the Gordon Ramsay, like me, or well, just me. Comment down below what video you want me to review. I'll be more than happy to do that. I'll catch you guys later. Take care. Bye.